Yeah. yeah. My God. Hello, Atlanta. How you feeling? Yes. Why the heck they got y'all standing up so long? <laughs> y'all all right? Y'all ready for Mr. Kimani Marley? What the? Did y'all see these people? Are y'all ready for Mr. Kimani Marley? Atlanta, I can't hear you. Are you ready for Kimani Marley? My God. Give it up, y'all. Yeah. to say it's a pleasure to be here in front of you wonderful and beautiful people and uh, I thank you for coming out and supporting you know not only my book but my legacy a part of what I stand for you know what I mean I really appreciate that um, with all my heart um, not really big on talking but since we are friends in the house you know, there's some Q and there. We can go on with a small reasoning. So if anybody have anything they want to say or ask, floor is open. Come on in. Then I yes. know um, the, 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 pro the progress in your life and all the outstanding, wonderful things you have done in your life. How do you see yourself further in your future and what is it that's motivating you to do so? What motivates me is you beautiful people. You know what I mean? That's, that's, that's where I get my inspiration from. Um, like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm just a messenger. So, you know, I, I like, my biggest thing is reasoning with people and understanding what their views are on the world. And um, be able to reason with them about mine and put that into music and hopefully, you know what I mean, um, it's a positive message that's being sent out there for, for, for the younger generation to follow mine. For me, it's really about carrying on my father's legacy while creating my own at the same time for my children to follow. So that's where I am with it. Thank you. <laughs> Next move in. Uh, I work on it, you know. Um, I've been trying to get shot us two together for quite some time now. So. Yes, yes, young man. Say that again. What got you interested in music? Wow, that's a good question. Because let me tell you, for me, growing up, I wasn't interested in music. Uh, for me, it was more about football, American football, and football as the world knows it. And I think my musical career started, you know, I say it all the time, it's almost as a fluke. My musical career started 
I was at a friend's house. I had a friend that, that spin turntable and played out, uh, played out on the weekends. And I was at a friend's house, just playing around on the mic, and an ex-producer of my father named Carl Peterson walked into the studio and you know, heard me on the mic and said to me, um, you have a nice tone. He didn't say you know how to sing or you sound like you can sing. He said, you have a nice tone. <laughs> <laughs> you should come to the studio on the weekends and you know what I mean, see what we can work out. And I started going there every Saturday for like two hours a day. And one thing led to the next. I wrote a song called Dear Dad, which I'll perform tonight. Greetings. Greetings. Uh, we're with SOI Magazine and we're here with Mr. Kamani Marley. Yes. My only question to you, sir, is where do you see yourself in another 10 or 20 years from now? Wow. Um, you know, my my... My mission is to, to, to continue this legacy. You know what I mean? So I approach that day to day. I'm not really one to plan for, for 10 years from now. Uncle the Almighty knows what he has in store for me at that point. But you know, my, my, my ultimate mission is really to continue this legacy and pass on the message of love, peace, and unity. So 10 years from now, I'll be doing this right here. That's a blessing. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mr. Yes, Kamani. Love. Bless. Yes. Thank you. Love, sister. Here you go. Do I have a sack of books that are signed? Thank you. Sir, I owe you three books signed? Yes. And a postal. Okay. You only gave me one? So you gave me one. You have two. Here's one. Do I have more that are signed? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. There you go. Everybody, I'm not going to be a person.